What is going on guys, it's me and Mikey here today, and today we're going to talk about the top 5 things we want in the next Call of Duty, whether it be Black Ops 3 or World at War 2, whatever the fuck you guys want it to be. In the background I got running a gameplay of me going 48 and 0 or 58 and 0, I don't know, something fucking ridiculous, it was amazing. But anyways, so this is the list of the top 5 things that we want. Okay, I'm going to start out with a list, and number 5, I would want theater mode. I really do miss theater mode back in Black Ops 2, and Black Ops 1, and all those, and in Modern Warfare 3, because it was good, because you can make good, funny videos. Like, we used to have videos of people fucking diving out of windows, blowing up on cars, just because it looked fucking funny. And it was, like, ridiculous, because you can make some amazing videos out of it. And such as in Ghost, if I had theater mode, I would have way more chem strikes on my channel, is I used to never record on Ghost, which I should have a lot more. And Mikey, what's your top five number? For you? Well, I do agree that for you, top your top five would definitely go towards you, considering you make videos on YouTube. Me, not so much, because I think it was kind of cool. Because you're, yeah, you can, you're just you the average and, uh, player. <laughs> yeah, I just play the game with you guys to socialize, but. I do think theater mode would be cool because there's some games where like I need to show you like dude look check I went like 48 and 12 on hardcore and you're like no you didn't I'm like I oh yes I did you. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well anyway I do think theater mode would be a cool thing but personally I feel like I'd rather have um, going back to a 25 kill streak which we'll get to later on but I don't like the 30 kill streak because I've gone 25 kills without uh dying in this game but if i got that in any other game i would have got a nuke so that's just my top five any other game from modern Warfare 2 and up besides the black ops series you would have got a nuke the mm. so black ops series is a champ is a series <laughs> that don't have nukes you got a tag right. so what was your top five i didn't catch that basically t 25 kill streak which kind of correlates with our you later want on. you want a 25 kill streak nuke for your number five yes or any kind of nuke for uh, black ops if that's the next game uh, all right, so my number I do not count right. I put number three twice. Okay, my number four <laughs> would have to be a uh, skill based mass skill based matchmaking, and of course it's already in it and it's been in the past Call of Duties. But the thing is, is I do not like how fucking strict it is in this one because one it's super strict. So if you're like me and you almost have a 2.0, if you're playing by yourself, it's fucking ridiculous. You have no point of playing. You have no hope. You're not going to do anything fun. But see, if you got someone like me who's got a low KD on your team, you can throw them in to go get the easiest games you've ever played in your life. You, mean, you said you. You know what? Shut your fucking face. You don't know. I'm sorry. So, <laughs> you can easily counteract with skill-based skill matchmaking in this game, and that's not really a good thing. The skill-based matchmaking should be something you can't just fucking skip around to go do whatever the fuck you want. So, I want it back to how it was in the old consoles where it made like a majority thing and it threw just most people together. The skill based matchmaking wasn't really strong, it was mostly based off level. Okay, and Mikey, what's your number four? I agree with you because, um, see, Shady has a pretty high KD, and that's just because he's been playing Call of Duty, I think, since like Call of Duty 4. Or anyway, the point is, like with my KD, his, my KD is usually around uh, 1. 11 or a 1.26 that's like my highest KD that was at my highest point in advanced warfare but with that said I have a lower KD than shady and when I now when he hosts lobbies I'm not having any fun because I'm getting my ass kicked by freaking guys who are freaking try yeah, people doing like fucking backflips 36 exactly keys, fucking dick slapping like amazing yes kids. yes and if, if it's even bad for me some of our other teammates who aren't because I'm actually close to shady skill level well I mean not really yeah. but I mean he's like, like one of the our, best out of all my crew I guess you could say that. Now, concerning Joey's uncle, <laughs> now when he plays with Joey, <laughs> he might as well commit suicide because though he yeah, has when no he, chance. He plays with me, he just gets quiet. He doesn't talk. He goes, man, I'm getting wrecked. And we look yeah. and he's going like, like 3 and he's 42. Going like 3 and 40 <laughs> something. But he has like 12 captures. I don't even know yeah. how he did it. Considering in fact there's only three objectives and we're only in the first quarter. Anyways, yeah. that's him. Yeah, <laughs> I do agree on the skill-based mass uh, skill-based matchmaking like the previous Call of Duties. I do agree on that one. Alright, so that would be your number four skill based matchmaking? Yes. All right. Or nude characters, but whatever. No, Mikey, we're not getting fucking nude okay. characters. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so number three, guys, what I would want, and this is really big for me, I want good killstreaks. And by good killstreaks, my definition of good killstreaks. Not advanced I, warfare. 
not advanced warfare every fucking <laughs> shit. The system hack, I hate it. It's good, but it's a simple and easy EMP yes. to get. The EMP needs to be hard to get because in every single game it was super hard to get, and when you did get Fuck it, yeah. totally just destroyed them. To get an EMP in like five kills is fucking ridiculous. It's like not even funny how easy it is to get them. I get them like no problem, and we can just wreck on people. But what I really want in the next Call of Duty is I want Specialist. If you don't know what Specialist is, Specialist is Infinity like if War. you, it's in most Infinity War games. Like if you were to go back to Ghost or to Modern Warfare, I think it was Modern Warfare Three. Modern Warfare Two did not have it, but um, it was basically instead of kills, you got perks, and you mm -hmm. for different perks for different things, they were different levels to get and shit. But after you stacked them up, you got like a big bonus where you either got a bunch of perks in Ghost, or if you played Modern Warfare Three, you got all the perks. So you were just like a fucking super soldier, and you were ridiculously strong. And I I want that and some decent kill streaks. I don't want the dog again. Don't bring the dog back. The dog nah. was fun, but keep it at ghost. That thing was fucking annoying, so there's no way to counteract it. <laughs> and Fuck the recon things. drones, get rid of those. I Fuck hate them. those things. Those dude. things are stupid. It really sucks when you're on like a 40 plus kill streak and they come fucking flying around the corner. <laughs> Pew, pew, just shooting you and you can't <laughs> hide from them no matter what. Or if you're in Shady's uh, case, they magically end up killing him somehow. Yeah, I've died from some fucking recon drones. We'll talk about that in another video. That'll probably be one of my rage <laughs> videos. <laughs> oh, okay, so Mighty, what's your number three? Uh, my number three, uh, I can't really argue with that. Uh, I hate... Advanced Warfare is one of my uh, better Call of Duties because it's the one... Because after playing Ghost with you... That really, out of all the Call of Duties, that really trained me to fight against, uh, you know, better players and a harder kind of gameplay. So with that said, uh, the kill streaks in this game are so like you think you get a good kill streak and they almost all suck. Like I run system hack and uh, bombing run and usually like a sentry gun. <laughs> they're not, they're really not that good. Like the ones you get in like previous Call of Duties, man, they would almost they would be a game changer. Like a chopper gunner, oh my god, dude, you guys would go on like. We, you'd get nukes instantly on Modern Warfare 2 if you got a chopper gunner, but yeah, basically, Modern Warfare yeah. 2 was good. You only needed mm -hmm. like a chopper gunner and a hair, and you got a nuke, and you won. Doesn't matter if you're going negative like 70, you fucking won the game. Okay, so that's yeah. what you're saying. It's pretty much the same thing as Shady was saying. I want better kill streaks because, especially for those who are, which is actually those of you who are avid players in Call of Duty, you need better kill streaks because these ones just aren't cutting it for us. So I agree. <sighs> I don't think Mikey has an opinion of his own anymore. So anyway, I don't really do. I can't really think of any right now. All right, guys. So number two, I would have to say is I want the nuke, such as in Mikey's fifth. And by a nuke, I either want the old-fashioned nuke. I want Fuck it yeah. back to a 25 kill streak. If it's a 25 kill streak, I don't care if you make it like the Moab. Don't make it like how the freaking DNA bomb is. It's so weak. I mean, don't get me wrong, it kills the whole team, that sounds stupid, me saying it's weak. But they made it 5 plus kills on the fastest Call of Duty ever fucking invented. And all it does, it's like, boom, green ends over. That's it. It's like a green giant queef. Yes, exactly, but I want it back <laughs> to how it was in like, End game you got a Moab game or a fucking Cam. Uh, game changer would be something else. Let me get to that. So I want it back to be a Moab or Kim, because after you called those in, they were EMP'd and it had a huge effect on them. So it wasn't like boom, boom, it's blown up, and now it's just back to normal. It's not just free kills. It actually like destroyed their team. And they couldn't call anything in. They were like system hacked. If you guys have not played Needle Bones, mm -hmm. and so, but it, bring it back to a 25 kill streak. Because if you're going to make it a 30. Bring it back to the game changer or the game ender. Because in Modern Warfare 2, if you got a nuke, the game was over. Doesn't matter if you were losing or anything. If you called in a nuke in Modern Warfare 2, you won. And it was great. Because it was so awesome to be able to play a game, be losing by like 20, and just be like, you know what? Screw you. Just five seconds, drop a nuke, you won the game. Doesn't matter if you're doing terrible, you fucking won. There's no way for them to counterfight it. Unless they call it EMP when the nuke is dropping. And I've only had that happen to me once. And I was <laughs> pissed. But <laughs> Anyways, Mikey, what's your second? Now, believe it or not, people, I promise you, this is my own opinion. Um, you know what, honestly, the one thing about Advanced Warfare that I absolutely love is the gun variants. I think they did an amazing job with that, changing it up a little bit, because using the same base guns over and over can be very exhausting. Now, yeah, Call of Duty... That. Advanced Warfare, <laughs> all the gun variants, man, I mean, some of them are just plain out shitty, but some of them, 
just bring a brand new chain. Some of them could just be overpowered, and they're very well balanced, like they are. I have to admit, they do a pretty good job at that. So I definitely want them to bring back gun variants or custom guns, something like that. Something where you can customize them, and there's different versions of the, the base gun. I want those. Want them to bring them back in the next Call of Duty. Definitely that. I'll take All that right. over a nuke any day. <laughs> I hear you on that. I do like hearing or having different types of guns. And shit. That actually does that pretty fun, but there is a lot of shit guns I hear you out on. Now, I would like... say that for my number one, but for what our number one is, I can't top that. So, we'll get to that in a second. All right, so, our number one, it's anonymous if you're me and Mikey. It doesn't matter who the fuck you are. Fuck you if you don't agree with me. I'll say <laughs> it proudly. Number you're one, gay? I want zombies. No, I'm not gay. You're queer. <laughs> if you don't believe me, watch the last video I uploaded. But anyways, guys, I want zombies. Zombies is my favorite thing in Call of Duty. I've said it in like 20 videos now. Zombies is the greatest. I know it's repetitive and you're doing the same shit. And you only get like five maps a game. But I'm fucking great at it. I love zombies. I don't know why. It's addicting. I'm fucking weird. And such as if it's a Treyarch game, they better have zombies. If they have special ops or something, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not even going to buy it if it has special ops or something. Don't br like when they finally bring Ghost 2 back, don't. The alien is alright, it's fun, but it's not zombies. Actual zombies is fun, it's lasting, but I really want legit zombies. They don't bring get me back wrong. Dead Ops. Dude, they bring back Dead Ops, I'm so <laughs> done. It's not even <laughs> funny. Uh, no, uh, okay, now this, this is both are agreed um number one we i mean i this is my story i hated zombies when i first played it because i started playing it in world at war i didn't even give a sh i didn't even know what it was before before it was an easter egg i didn't even like it so black Ops one came okay i played it with my friends and shady a couple times at his house but even then i wasn't that big of a fan i mean it was kind of cool but i wasn't good at it i didn't know how to play it i didn't enjoy it and then in black ops 2 Shady would be like, I'd be playing multiplayer, and be like, hey, Mike, you want to play zombies? And I'd be like, not really. And he goes, come on, dude, let's play it. I'll teach you how to play. I'm like, fine. And he taught me how to play it the right way, and I've I loved it ever since. I would drag his ass in the lobbies and make him play. No, he would, he and he wouldn't play. leave me alone. He would call me, I was me, like, no, text you're me. fucking playing with me. I'll text him, call him, bug him, bug him at school, do whatever I <laughs> needed to to get him to come play zombies. And in the but end, it paid off. He loves it. Oh, dude, I would miss school to play that, and since Joey wasn't the most uh, avid student, we would both, sometimes both play hooky just to sometimes play zombies all day and get, find the Easter eggs, and that shit was fun. So, zombies for my number one, definitely. Yeah, you, you can't argue with zombies, and I know a lot of people hate it and stuff. That's their opinion, but my opinion, zombies is like the fucking overlord games. I want a Call of Duty zombies. I swear to God, if they made a Call of Duty zombies only, if just Call of Duty zombies, I would be sick. That'd be fucking awesome. I would never buy a new Call of Duty again. I would play zombies. I'd be like number one in the world. I would play that shit till I was number one in the world. I would be fucking done. I'd be ready. I would be in fucking tournaments and shit with that bitch. Oh my God, that thing. Real would be quickly, amazing. shitty. I know Yo. you were kind of a. Uh, pushing our time limit here which is not a big deal but what, how would you like cyborg zombies like they have in the Chinese versions now how would you like that and rather uh, I mean let's say they did took out regular zombies and added those things or something like them so I feel like that's tr what they tried to do with aliens they tried to bring aliens to ghosts but they didn't those things are zombies. nothing like zombies yeah but you get what I'm saying they're trying to add yes. another mode to uh, take on the role of zombies but since it's infinity or er, since it's fucking infinity ward they don't want to take Treyarch zombies and like be like haha yes. we're doing it too which mm -hmm. would be awesome because i love infinity ward guns but that's not the point anyways so um cyborg zombies i would be perfectly fine with considering the fact it's the exact same thing except it's the they're same cyborgs. maps it's the same shit though it's the same map it's it's basically the same game except when they brought it over to china zombies is like <laughs> something if it is against our religion i'm not saying that'd be funny it's 100 percent real they tr they try not to talk about that shit because it's bad for their culture and stuff so instead they they like overlooked it with like a futuristic alien freaking cyborg zombie look blue blood so, yeah so it's basically the exact same thing except, except they took off the skin and yeah. put a new skin on it so i would yeah. be perfectly fine with that as like, long as it played I, the same way yeah, as long as it played the same way, but I would really prefer just having normal zombies. Cool. It's zombies. But if you got a cyborg zombies, don't get me wrong, I'd play it. I'd be good at it. I would have fun, but it's not zombies. Alright, so this is like the end of the video, so we're going to throw it in. Mikey, what do you want your next game to be? What do you want Call of Duty 2015 to be? You know, considering uh, it's going to be made by Treyarch, 
Um, I would say Ghost if it was Infinity Ward. If we knew it was Infinity <laughs> Ward, definitely Ghost because I love Ghost, man. I love that realism. I love the way it is. But I'm going to have to say between an old school Call of Duty, like which I know a lot of us are kind of looking forward to, like maybe a Vietnam-based one or, I don't know, World War Two or some kind of make-up World War Three. I would rather have a Black Ops 3. And I, how I'd want it, I'd want it like Black Ops 2 was. It went back and forth between the past and to the future. Because I think we've had a little bit too much of future, so that's my what I'd rather want. Kind of like a back and forth, retro future kind of Black Ops 3. I, I hear so. you out on that. If it was Infinity Ward, hell yeah, I'd want Ghost. If fuck you guys man. know me, I'm a huge Ghost fan. You guys can say fuck you, whatever, you're stupid. Everybody hates Ghost. The YouTube community hates it. That's your opinion. I'm not a kid who just came in on Ghost and I'm like, oh my god, Ghost is amazing. I've been playing back since like Modern Warfare, like the original. Like, yes. I, I remember playing World at War on the day it was released. I've been playing Call of Duty since forever now. But the thing is, I've always been an Infinity Ward friend or friend fucking fanboy. I don't know. I've always liked <laughs> those. I like Ghost a lot. Ghost is a good game to me. So Hell if yeah. it was Infinity Ward, I would want Ghost too. That would be awesome. But, um, so, let's see, for the next one, I, I'm going to be bummed if it's Black Ops 3, to be honest, because if it's Black Ops 3, I know we're not going to have the nuke, because they never have a fucking nuke. <laughs> they have a metal. <laughs> the nuclear <laughs> metal is, like, the biggest, like, middle finger to the face ever. It's like, it's congratulations, so nice. you would have had it, but no. Nope. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, then there's the possibility of a World at War 2. World at War is my second favorite Call of Duty. If they bring it World at War 2, please make it gory. Make it like World at War yes. 2. There was nothing like running around with a trench gun, some dude walker corner, boom, just fucking blowing off their arm. Uh, they Black Ops like, 1 was pretty gory. There, which, Black Ops 1 was a little bit gory, but it wasn't like World at War. World at yeah, War, you can you throw mean. a grenade and just blow off their legs. Yeah. But if it's World, I would prefer a World at War 2, or whatever they would call it. But the way things are going with all the leaks, it looks like it's going to be a Black Ops 3. But yes. the way things are going, people are making it appear as it is a Vietnam-based game, which is Black Ops 1. So uh, I'm wondering if it's a back yeah, in time. Yeah. So within, two, within, the, yeah, within the time frame, I would want the Call of Duty game to be more of an old game. Let's keep the modern and futuristic games to Infinity Ward. I feel like they do good as that. They need okay, to stay that with that. Sense. Black Ops did good with Black Ops 2, don't get me wrong. It wasn't that far in the future. It was still pretty modern base. Kind of. The thing is, yeah, but I mean, like, you got the microwave shit. But that's not <laughs> the thing is, I didn't like Black Ops 2. We've talked about that many times. But I yes. want a World at War 2. It would just be awesome for me to finally have World at War 2. Is if they do, then they would bring back zombies, and it would be gory. And I just love World War II era. I'm a huge fist history I agree. geek. I don't know why. Uh, I like World War II because I like the, the the American. I'm kind of a patriot, patriot, so I love the fucking yeah, U.S. victories. America. Iwo Jima. Oh my god, man! I'll, I'll jerk off to that picture sometimes. I won't lie. The fuck okay. my way. Okay, if you wonder what I said to that, that's I'm getting removed off the video. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it's been now 18 minutes. If you sat through the yeah. whole thing, I fucking love you guys. I don't know why you would sit here and listen to us ramble yeah. about stupid shit. Uncle but anyways, Mikey guys, loves you guys too. Yeah, Uncle Mikey loves you too. Oh, that's really bad. My Uncle Mike's in prison. <laughs> but we'll have that talk to every time. <laughs> but um, this Mikey, on the other hand, is too stupid to go to prison. Um, yeah. What? <laughs> Yeah, you heard me. Okay, so, anyways, guys, if you did wait through the whole thing, please leave in the comments your fucking, what your top five would be, and on ours, tell us if you do think what we thought was good, or why we're stupid, why our ideas are stupid, and what you think the next Call of Duty game will be, and what you want it to be, guys. Alright, later on, guys, I'm out. Like and subscribe later. for more. Anything else, Mikey, you would like to say? Uh, what do you Oh, my God. Oh, my nice. God. Uh, Later on, guys. Full sign.